The continent has been drifting. Australia has moved by more than a metre and a half in the last two decades. It's all because of tectonic shifting, but now poses a new challenge for scientists. Australia is a country on the move. It's shifting to the north and slightly to the east by about seven centimetres each year. That's because the continental plate it sits on is the fastest moving on the Earth. That means that the orbits um, that the satellites are in are fixed to the centre of the Earth, and yet our continental plate is moving in relation to that. The centre of the Sydney Opera House is marked as being at 33 degrees 51 minutes and 24.4 seconds south, 151 degrees 12 minutes and 55.1 seconds east. But because of the constant shifting, those coordinates are off the mark. So the Opera House is actually over here. If it keeps going unchecked, geoscientists say it'll be out by nearly two metres by the year 2020. To put it another way, if I stood on this spot for the last 22 years, I would technically have moved about one and a half metres. So today if I'm standing here, in 1994, I would have been standing over there. But of course it isn't quite that simple. It means services that use latitude and longitude data, like online maps, transport and even agriculture, are not precise. For those of us uh, such as surveyors that need to measure things to less than a centimetre, this five millimetre change per month does impact measurements and we need to account for it. Experts are now recalculating the coordinates, also known as geocentric datum. It is a pretty large task from a coordination point of view. And if we continue moving, Sydney will be where Brisbane is in about 10 million years. Josh Bavis, ABC News. Oh, we won't be around for that.